guys, welcome back to day 14 of 25 days of Christmas with TJ. Um, yesterday, as you saw, we are continuing down steam and we started getting into my premier steam engines. Um, the steam engine for tonight I chose actually has a really cool meaning and a story behind it. Um, I was about six years old, somewhere near five, six, and my father took a career path change and was down in Spartanburg, South Carolina for some training. And there's a hobby shop down there that he went to and he got there right as they were closing. And this particular engine was running around the display layout in the hobby shop. And the lady that lady and the, her husband who ran the shop were talking to my dad outside as they were closing up and said that that was a new engine that had just come in and that if he was interested, she would take a percentage off of the uh, price on it because it was running on the layout. And my dad was able to make it back the next day and purchase it. And it was an engine that he purchased as kind of a new career present to himself, you know, accomplishment kind of present to himself for doing so. And I remember him bringing home this engine and we had a relatively small layout in the house that I grew up in. And I remember running it around frequently and how amazing it was. It was one of the first Proto 2 steam engines and it was just absolutely insane. Um, fast forward now, what, 12 years? 13 years roughly and he has had he's got some more of these engines and uh, the opportunity came up for me to purchase it from him and he gave me a good price on it obviously being his son and uh, I took it and it's just cool to me because I have an engine that I remember as a kid and I love running it it's a great engine and it continues on with the family tradition I guess if you will and that engine would be this Premier H10. Now, obviously, everyone probably has seen a Pennsylvania H10 from MTH over the years, and this was one of the very first ones that they ran. Fun engine. Craziest thing about it is, is it's got some of the most unique steam sound or uh, chuff sounds, and some of the best sounds that I've heard or have heard from one of the earlier steam engines. And it does have the Banshee whistle, but the chuff sound always impressed me and I love it. And it's part of the reason why I love running it today. But that's, you know, for me, it's really cool to have an engine that my dad purchased, you know, at a, at a high point in his, his life and, you know, as a presence to himself. And then I was able to get it from him and, you know, hold on to it. So we'll go ahead and get running this H10. And a quick thing, um, Kind of got some surprises in the work. I know I've mentioned this, but for either Christmas Eve or Christmas Day, there will be a, a pretty cool surprise and uh, something interesting to watch. And it'll be a longer video than the, the ones that we've been doing so far. So I hope you guys uh, are following along, really enjoying what I'm doing. I'm enjoying putting out the content for you guys. So like, subscribe, share it with somebody, comment, really enjoying hearing all those things. But Again, I'll stop, I'll stop uh, babbling here and we'll go ahead and run this H10 around the layout. 